Is your refrigerator running? That beginning to a very bad joke is especially not funny for a lot of families who can firmly say no, their fridge is not running, even though it's not very old. Consumer investigator Chris Camora says some folks contacted our response team for help. Others, however, contacted a lawyer and are now making a big federal case out of their failed fridges. One morning I went to get the milk out and it was sour. Betsy Anderson's luck with refrigerators stinks as badly as the food she's tried to keep cold. First, a $2,800 Kenmore fridge with an LG compressor inside died in late 2019. It just basically stopped working. It wasn't cold. Betsy filed for warranty service, but after two months of replacement parts failing and Thanksgiving approaching, what do I do? She broke down and bought another fridge, a brand new LG. It only lived four years. And that just died this year. Same thing. We did, I didn't even bother calling them. If you're keeping score, that's one Redwood City home with two dead fridges in just five years. Yeah, two. And unfortunately, we bought another LG fridge, so I guess that is the definition of insanity, right? Betsy's not alone. We searched our nationwide response complaint database. Over the past couple of years, our NBC and Telemundo sister stations around the country have heard from dozens of upset LG and Kenmore owners. It's sort of like a ticking time bomb. Therese in Philadelphia said her fridge failed when it was only seven months old. Bernadette in San Diego said technicians have been to my home seven times, which sounds a lot like care in LA's story. Fix lasted one week. I've had a total of six repair visits and have not had a working refrigerator for two months. It's a nationwide issue. LA attorney Azar Mazari represents plaintiffs who are now suing LG. She says her firm is focused on a critical part called the linear compressor inside LG and some Kenmore refrigerators. Which is really the heart of the refrigerator. It's what keeps the food cold. LG offers a 10-year warranty and online boasts 20-year durability. But Mazari argues in the lawsuit the linear compressor's actual lifespan is nowhere near 10 years, let alone 20. Her suit claims they frequently break down far earlier, and LG knows it. She's asking a federal judge to make her lawsuit a class action because she believes droves of families are facing the same breakdown. Thousands, if not tens of thousands. I mean, we have been inundated with calls. LG previously faced litigation over its refrigerators, including compressor failures. In 2018, LG settled this different class action lawsuit. Mazari's suit is new and makes a new claim, fraud. She argues in the suit that LG is defrauding people like Betsy because it continues to make a linear compressor that falls short of its 20-year durability. We know that they've known about this issue and they know that the rate of failure is just unreasonably high. Mazari also names in her suit several major national chain stores that sold LG and Kenmore refrigerators. Because those retailers um, were aware of the issue. We contacted LG and Kenmore about the lawsuit. LG told our LA response team the company does not comment on pending litigation. It's fighting the suit in court. When LG settled the previous class action suit, the agreement said LG specifically denies any alleged defect in the LG refrigerators. Kenmore says it no longer sells refrigerators with an LG compressor. Mazari says the new lawsuit is gaining traction. So currently we have 102 plaintiffs. She wants LG to extend people's warranties up to 20 years and refund anyone like Betsy who says they bought a dud LG or Kenmore or two. It's a tremendous hassle. After 2018. Well, I think they should make it right. And I think that they should do a recall similar to an automaker. If you own or owned an LG or Kenmore refrigerator and bought it after 2018, you can scan this QR code to find out more about the lawsuit.